We welcome you to the Southern Conference Game of the Week presented by Ingalls. Here at Jerry Richardson Indoor Stadium in Spartanburg, South Carolina, the Mercer Bears are in town to take on the homestanding Wofford Terriers. Cameron Jackson. And from the right wing, Storm Murphy. And Murphy starts to scoring a Whopper team. That hits him at 40% beyond the arc, and Murphy at 46%. And that's Nathan Hoover, defended by Stair, baseline jumper. Hoover. Nathan Hoover, five quick points. One. He under duress here is Murphy. And Storm Murphy lighting it up. And one star coming into the weekend, and Mercer was in the game right down to the end. Jackson inside. That's what the 6'8 senior can do. Hollowell up under and in. Trey Hollowell, a sophomore, who started to add to the offense a little bit. Out of hustle by Aluma. Jackson and one. This from the 6'10 sophomore out of Brazil. McGee, and that's the first Trey. The first bucket on the night for Fletcher McGee. And McGee. McGee, the catch, the shoot, and a second tray on the night, and Fletcher McGee almost got that one falling down. Jackson, Hollowell from the right wing. That is what makes Wofford so dangerous, is even if McGee misses a shot, they have shooters everywhere. And he's stolen by Stowe. Jackson, Aluma with a jam. On that the defense that time by Hoover. And a feed and a finish. Oh, nice job that time. Storm Murphy. Swafford looking to build on their biggest lead. And up and counted. By Cam Jackson, but a good one dribble. Attack the basket strong and an excellent finish. Sir, we'll see if Mercer can capitalize on that tech. And Bafuto rejected from behind by Aluma. Hollowell going to give it away. Murphy back to Hollowell. And the three for Trey Hollowell, the sophomore out of Hopkinsville, Kentucky, 30. That might be the biggest shot of the game so far for Wofford. Kilby didn't realize he'd knocked the ball away from his teammate. Here's Murphy. And just like that, Wofford's back in front, a 5-0 run by the Terriers, and they just don't get rattled. Lost to North Carolina, and they hung with them late into that season opening contest. No for Aluma, but kicks it on the follow. Bring get together at Portsmouth, Virginia. That's always a big scouting session. Look at Hollowell take it away. Came into the ball game with 13 steals. The other end by himself, and he goes around stair. Trey Hollowell, have yourself a game. Hurry for most threes made all time in the league. Give the block to Jackson that time on the drive by Stowe. Hollowell for Murphy. Jackson down the lane. There's not much you can do. One dribble and he throws it down, and he had a big dunk on Thursday against the... The defensive end instead of the offensive end. We've seen Cam Jackson do all sorts of things, but I don't know if we've seen him with his back to the basket. McGee catches, fires, got it, and he'll head to the line. I can't believe that shot. I cannot believe that shot. Fletcher McGee is worth the price of admission. Come see Wofford play just to watch this guy shoot the ball again, squares his feet in the air, <laughs> takes the contact in front of his own bench. Folks, that is such an incredibly difficult shot from Fletcher McGee. Looked low for Aluma. Now to McGee behind a screen, and that's going to tie it. Fletcher McGee has even things up with Steph Curry, his 414th career three-pointer now has the Tie for the lead, all time in the Southern Conference. Seconds, give or take. Murphy got out of control. Wide open, McGee, and that's the record. Fletcher McGee becomes the all-time Southern Conference. Three-pointers made record holder. He just passed Steph Curry of Davidson. And Mike Young able to call a timeout. His team has built their lead to a two-possession advantage at four points. Witnessing history tonight in Spartanburg. Dmitrievich or Stair perhaps, and Stair can't get the roll. Fittingly, Fletcher McGee on his big night will dribble it out on the Waffer Terriers. They got all they could handle tonight from the Mercer Bears, but a Terrier team that improves to 4-0 in SoCon play. They'll hold first place by themselves. They go to 12-4 overall. 78 to 74 winners tonight.